I'm gonna cry. It has officially been five hours. I can smell it. I actually can't. I'm wearing a mask. He might be. I wasn't sure if I should keep that secret from you guys or just tell you. Don't make the same mistake I did. I feel like I did it the worst way possible. Was that your ready for Spider-Man stance? <laughs> My alarm went off at like at 6.45 because you can get in a virtual queue at 7 a.m. for Web Slingers, which is the new Spider-Man ride, which is, you know, one of the really big things that they want to do here. Right after my alarm went off, I got up, I started getting ready, and they popped up out of bed, and they're like, what are we leaving? They really want to get there early. So a series of unfortunate events have occurred thus far this morning. I woke up at 7 a.m., and in order to get on the, the ride Web Slingers, which is the new Spider-Man ride, you have to get into a virtual queue. Boys, Kaden, put your socks on and your shoes. Let's go. Getting in that virtual queue is the only way that you can ride web slingers. So, Landon, boys, please stop fighting. Come here. Why are you limping like an old man? If you don't get into that virtual queue, then you don't ride the ride. There are two options throughout the day where you can try to get on this ride. One at 7 a.m. and one at noon. Three for us, because we also have tomorrow. Because of the way that Disneyland is right now, you have to make park reservations, and you can choose between doing a single day park or a park hopper park. There's two parks in Disneyland. There's California Adventure and there's Disneyland. If you want to do the park hopper, you can, but you have to pick which day, which park you start in on which day. I hope you're following so far. So we did the park hoppers both day, and like I said, the only way to get onto this ride is the virtual queue. They have one at 7 a.m. and one at 12 a.m. However, you can only join the 7 a.m. queue if your starting park, you have to tell them what park you're gonna start in, is California Adventure. Because of that, tomorrow I'm not able to try the 7 a.m. queue. I'm only able to try the 12 p.m. queue. So I got up super early this morning. I actually left the the room because my service in here is not great and I think that's that contributed to why I didn't get it, get the 7 a.m. queue last time we were here when I was trying to get the Rise of the Resistance ride because the internet was not great. So I went outside where I had full service. I had five bars, 5G. I sat out there for a good like three minutes refreshing my page starting at 6.58. I refreshed it up until 7 a.m. And it said join, which is a good sign. I clicked join and then it said time slots are sold out. So all of that to say, we did not get the 7 a.m. tickets for web slingers. That doesn't mean that we can't go into Avengers Campus though. We still can. We're just gonna have to wait in a standby line, which I've heard is hours long. So we're trying to decide what to do. We're trying to decide because we're definitely gonna try, go put your shoes on cake. We're definitely gonna try again at noon. And if you do get the virtual queue, then you don't have to wait in the line. You just get right in. You just go right into Avengers Campus, which is the main thing that we're going for right now. Boys, I need you to stop wrestling, please. Shoes now. So that was unfortunate event number one. Unfortunate event number two, I don't mean to be a complainer, but we've never stayed at this hotel before. This is uh, a new hotel. I wanted to stay the one that we normally stay at, but I booked it to last minute. They were sold out of, out of rooms. So we booked this one that's like a mile and a half down the street. But I was like, oh, that's no big deal. They have a shuttle that brings you to the entrance of Disneyland. I learned last night when we were checking in that because of COVID, the, the shuttle isn't working, which means we're gonna have to walk, which is fine. No, it's not. Wait, wait, I what's mean, a shuttle? A shuttle is like a bus that takes you over there. That's pretty much our only option, unless we called an Uber. Unfortunate event number three. This morning when we woke up, I've never stayed at this hotel before, they said they had continental breakfast. So not only is the show not working, but they're also not serving continental breakfast. They just have a grab and go bag. And, when, and I was like, okay, that's fine. Like, you know, you can't be that bad. It's that bad. So I, I went down there this morning and I grabbed a bag in which they gave us a little box of juice. A and a rotten apple. I don't, know, I don't know if it's rotten, it's just, it looks a little bruised. And a raisin snail thing. So, that's what we're having for, for breakfast. No, we're not. We're not much like sweet eaters for breakfast, and this is all really sweet stuff. We normally just eat like bagels, but it's fine. Everything's fine. We're gonna have a great day. I didn't bring a toaster because it said that they had breakfast here. That's the only reason, because normally I bring a toaster, and I would have. Ah, uh, I'm kicking myself in the butt, so I will remember that for next time. However, none of that is going to stop us from having an amazing day. We're so excited, so we're leaving right now. Whoa. We're gonna start walking because it'll take us, it says it's about a 15-ish minute walk. 
We'll be the judge of that. It is 8.08. Do you have extra ones? I do. The park opens at nine. We're gonna try to get there a little bit early. At this point, I think we'll probably get there right on time. But now, the current situation is we're trying to figure out if it's worth it since we didn't get the virtual queue this morning. We're trying to figure out if it's worth it to stand in the line to get into Avengers Campus or if we should just try again at 12 and hope that we get in. Cause then you don't have to wait in the lines to get in. It's not good, it's a beautiful day. Look at this, at least it's not hot. Oh, that's the worst if it's hot. I haven't for no. <laughs> We made it through security and we're off. It is 8.47, the park opens at nine and it appears that they have already opened the parks early and started letting people oh, in. Oh, oh, we're in. Before it opens, 10 minutes before it opens. Makes you wonder what time they open the doors. 10 minutes? Yeah, they're not even open yet, you guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, so. Yeah, look at that. Whoa, my gosh, so many good foods. So much good food. Okay, walk fast. Let's go see how long the line is. Okay, I'm going to get <laughs> oh, come on. I don't care. This is it. This is it right here. This is the line. He said it's better to do it now. You said it's better to do it now, you think? To be honest, yes, because okay. it's going to stay at about four to five all day. And right now, it's pretty cool. Okay. Yay. Thank you so much. Oh. You can do it. You can do it in the end. You can do it. Okay, this came there. Okay, there. Please have to mess up. There it is. I don't know. That would be cool, huh? Oh my gosh, we see it. They started hearing the music and freaking out. Update, Avengers Campus is way down there. We've wrapped around this way, back through this way, and then we still have to wrap through here, back through. Mom, I dropped my thing, Mom, I dropped my fan. Did you really? I'm gonna kick your butt, Tushy. I'm gonna kick your Tushy. So yeah, around this way, this way, this way, and then back down the line into Avengers Campus over there. I just ran into a girl who watches my videos and she was telling me that she got here at 7 a.m. and they told her it was a five hour wait. So, not gonna, we're gonna stay home. Uh, pass. Okay, um. Ooh. Ah! <laughs> I think we should get a close, no, 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 it's a ride. Oh, okay. Um, yeah! <laughs> Update, it is 9.31, so we've been in line for about 30 minutes. And we downloaded, um, what is this game called? Heads Up, and we have a Disneyland. Oh, look at, you can see the video. <laughs> shows you like what we were doing oh my God. when we we're trying to act it out. It's hard to act it out when you wear a face mask. Update, it is 10.35. So we've yeah, been in line for an hour and a half now, a little over an hour and a half. And we met our friends, Sebastian and Kaya. They came and said hi, and they had decked out, and all, they just came out of Avengers yeah, Campus. And look what they gave us. Isn't that so sweet? Yeah. They pin trade, so they gave us these pins, so they're gonna start their own like collection. And they have a spider bot, which is the one thing that my kids are like so obsessed with. They want it so bad. And he's got this, the Iron Man thing. Let's see if we can figure it out. Technical difficulties. <laughs> Technical difficulties. It's okay, so is this line. This line stopped moving. It like keeps looking like it's moving, and then it's not moving. Oh, it's working. It's working. oh, oh. It was, maybe, maybe not. The kids are so tired of waiting in line already. Oh, there it's moving. So this is keeping them going, the excitement of what's inside of there. Look at that! Oh, and they battle each other, right? Whose pin, did you drop the pin, guys? Whoa, why did it, what? why did it do that? That's how you like switch off the like. Oh, I was like, I think he surrendered. He got shy. He got shy. He's like, I'm new to this, guys. How does it fight? How does it fight? I have no idea. Oh my it's, God. it's new. <laughs> no one really knows yet. The Avengers Campus is only two days old, so he's a baby bot. Hi, little guy. It's so heavy. It's kind of cute. So while we're waiting in line, let's have our very first official it's fight it's with a spider bot. Spider bot versus camera. Okay, ready, set. See who wins. The one on the slow side. Everybody attack! Get back! Oh! <laughs> Can I try to Spider bot versus water oh. bottle. Look at 
the water bottle win? <laughs> <laughs> Dasani is superior. <laughs> it's going again, it's going again. Oh, it's almost there. It's almost there. It's almost there. It is 11 a.m. now. We're actually out of line and we are so incredibly grateful right now. So our new friends that we made, they watch our videos and they came up and they've been chatting with us and they already went into Adventist campus and they've been telling us everything about it. They're regulars here, the sweetest people ever. And she actually offered, cause she doesn't like roller coasters, she offered to wait in the line for us. That way we could take the boys on a ride really quick. <laughs> I'm just so grateful. So I'm just so, 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 so incredibly grateful. So she's waiting in line and we're gonna take all the boys onto Incredicoaster, which is right next to where we're standing in line right now. It's not next to Avengers Campus, but it's next to the line. It says it's a 30 minute wait for Incredicoaster right now. And I'm sure that that line is gonna be a lot longer than 30 minutes. The boys are being so patient. I'm so proud of them because nobody likes waiting in line, especially little kids. And they've been so, so good. phones out because at 12 o'clock is the second virtual queue to try to get on. Kaden, we can't get them yet to try to get on to Web Slingers. So there's probably going to be a surge of people trying to do this right now. This line has not moved. We got here at nine, so it's been three hours since we've been standing in this line. And my app is going really slow, so I think I'm going to walk Out. Oh, by the way, how cool is my shirt? I didn't even show my shirt this morning. Look at it, Spider-Man! Spider-Man. We ever get in? Yeah, that is. Well, I've got to get in right now, though. Let us get in, employees. Everybody's alarms are going off. Everybody's alarms are going off. 59. It's 59? 59. Uh, are you loading? I'm too scared to load it too early because... What time is it? I'm 59. Nobody got it. And that's a no. They didn't get it. You can see all the people that did get it though. All the roars of happiness we didn't get it didn't get it oh my god that's such a bummer they got it look they're all gonna leave now now our line's gonna go fast see i told you yeah because everyone who just got a pass is just gonna wait to come back <laughs> he can sleep up too <laughs> we just excited when we talk back <laughs> not yet we're still in line we took a bath and break and then found him <laughs> It has officially been five hours, or almost five hours, since we got in this line, since we got here. Yeah, five hours, she's right. Since we got here and got in line, and we can finally, finally at least see it from here. So it, the thing, the reason why it's taking so long is because it depends on how many people are coming out of Avengers Campus. So once you go in, you're not obligated to leave by any specific time. So when people go in there, they, you know, if they want to stay all day, they can do that. But it just means that people outside have to wait. And I give it a few more weeks and it probably will never be like this again. So it is kind of silly for us to do this, I guess, if you look at it that way. 
but it's something that they're always gonna remember and they're super excited. I seriously am so proud of you guys. You guys have done so amazing, like so amazing. They got a little bit antsy a little while, for a little while there, but they've been doing overall really good. I hope you guys, I hope it's worth it to you guys. I do have to say, after being in line, for this long. I regret getting in the line right away, even though the guy told us, like right when we got there, he was like, this line is really good. Um, I would stand in it now. He said it's four to five hours no matter what time of day. I have to disagree, because the line now, and it's just now starting to get a little bit longer again, but it's significantly shorter, and it's 1.45 now, so the line now is a lot yeah, shorter. Yeah, like here like five hours. What? Yeah, five hours. The line is a lot shorter now than it was when we first got in here. I think people have the idea that if you know, you're know you getting there early, we got there early, not early compared to other people, because I've been talking to people and some people got here at like five and six and seven, and we get here at like 8.30, so it was nothing compared to those other people. If you don't get here at like five in the morning, I, I don't know, this is, I've only been here one day, but I would not recommend getting in this line right away because I feel like as we've gone through the line, it's only gotten shorter from when we got in it, if that makes sense. That being said, you live and you learn. I, you didn't, we didn't know, we thought about doing that. Kaden and I were talking before we left, we're like, do we get in the line right away, or do we wait a little bit and get in the line later, see if we get web slingers, and then decide. We ultimately decided to go straight to Avengers Campus because they're so excited to go in it. So I don't regret it, but just to learn from my experience, because I, I, if I could have done it differently, I think I would have. I think I would have taken them on other rides first and then gotten in the line after the fact. But you didn't know it at first? We didn't know, yeah. We, we had no idea how the line is. It's only been open for two days, so hardly anybody probably even knew that. We're almost there. We can see Cars Land is right here, and it's just past that. We're getting close. That being said, it still might be like, I don't even know, like an hour, I don't know. At one point, we contemplated getting out of line and going, going and doing other stuff, but we were like, you know what? We already wasted our day doing this. Like, we're, we're committing. We're fully committing. We're getting in. Two o'clock, and we can see it. We can see it. We can see the Spidey building. We can see it better a second ago, but we're getting closer. We're getting close. We can see it. Look at, I can smell it. I actually can't, I'm wearing a mask, but I think I can smell it. I can see it. I'm gonna freaking out now. Please, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out. Welcome to Avengers Campus. Ah! <laughs> I made him re-say that just for the video, so I hope you appreciate that. Oh my God! <laughs> show, huh? I'm so happy I'm in. Me too, baby. Like, we did it. Did we? The show was getting ready to start. Oh my god, you're gonna make me cry. I'm it so excited. It starts up there, but it ends here. <gasps> Where's the best place? Back here? Yeah, back here somewhere. That's why all these people Thank you so much for telling me that. Like, we're starting right now? Yeah, it's about to start. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Like, it's about to start right now? This is about to start. Right now? <laughs> I'm gonna cry. We waited five and a half hours. We get inside in the, sh the show, like the most epic Spider-Man show that everybody I've talks about. I've never seen that. It's about to start, like that was meant to be. Mom, you're gonna make me cry. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, look! Ah! Why am I freaking out? I'm a 29 year old girl. There he is. Oh, it's ah! Time for a little Spidey exercise. Ah! Oh my God. Hey everyone, it's good to see you. Hi, welcome to Avengers Campus. Watch this. Okay. Okay, no pressure. But how are 
are a lot of people watching. dreams because I just told him that the Spider-Man that flies is animatronic. I wasn't sure if I should keep that secret from you guys or just tell you. I'm sorry that I've crushed your dreams, son. How did that look like an animatronic? It's an animatronic. I'll show you. There's like videos on YouTube of like all of the behind the scenes stuff. Can you show me in the when we're eating? Yeah, I'll show you. Yeah, I'll try to find it. I don't even know what to do. I'm freaking out and trying not to cry, but we're actually able to ride web slingers. <laughs> oh, it looks like it's like it's a race board, like a racer board marker, but it's not. And now our project lead, the brilliant oh Peter Parker. Hey, what's up? I'm Peter Parker, and here at Web, we got access to some pretty awesome tech, like vibranium from Wakanda, or this crazy alien juice stuff. We have pin particles and Star Tech. It all helps us develop really cool stuff like um, like these spider bots, for example. Check it out, they have this really cool self replicating feature. Because? Uh, because it's awesome. That's so, anyway, here. if you want to sling a web, all you gotta do is sling your arm in the direction you want to shoot the web, and that's it. That's all. Peter, your spider bots are continuing to replicate and they're consuming everything in their path. <sighs> They seem to be stuck in self recognition mode. If you could just handle that for me, please. Uh oh. Bannon has new best friends. We bonded over the last five hours being in line together. And they're seriously the coolest people. They actually knew one of the cast members. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. drains wallets fast. You pick one, you pick one, yeah. Why don't you put this down for a second? It's not gonna crawl away. I think there's three different ones. This is for that. We made it into the web store, which is where you buy the spider bots, which is like the most epic thing. That's like the thing well, about this place that everybody wants. Maybe, I'm not sure how to see. So of course they're each getting their own bots so they can battle each other. Uh huh. It has a two power bot, it just fits Spider-Man. Whoa. And I can like take off that, that I can like actually shoot web. Whoa. I do have an uh, annual pass or a legacy pass. I mean, so come prepared to spend a pretty penny if you have Spider Man loving children because each spider bot you buy the bot and then you buy like the case for it, which like does cool stuff, I guess. And then this um, is like a web slinger, so this I don't even know what this does actually. So there's this and there's another piece to this that's like the battery pack and it's all sold separately. Plus they got a Spider-Man jacket, so it's not even like they went like super crazy, like they each got two toys and one jacket. And with all of that, it was $850, but I have a legacy pass holder discount, so it went down to $750. So be mindful of that if you're coming with your spider boys. of a 
assembling things later. I think almost everything is put together. One thing that I have to say is really, really cool is they have these backpacks for the little Spidey bots or whatever they are, the spider bots, and they can actually hold the spider bot on it. That way, you're not stuck carrying a toy, and they're not stuck carrying a toy. They just, I got this backpack, and they just, they had their like slings that they had like their water in, and snacks, and so we just transferred everything that was in that into the backpack, plus they can have their spider bot on it as well. This is my favorite part about everything that they just got, because they can hold all of their stuff, and it's a really creative way for it to be put onto the front of it. We're getting our, all of our little attachments, and then we really need to get some food in these kids. They've been doing nothing but snack. They haven't eaten anything except that breakfast that we had earlier, and then um, dry top ramen standing in line. Oh, and one churro. We did get them one churro. Standby lane was closed down because they were at capacity. So they have these little shwar, shwarma, shwarma, shwarma. It's healthy. Shwarma, no, it's not. But it's not healthy for you. Shwarma carts. And I got one of each um, just for us to like snack on until we can get into Pim's kitchen. So there's one that's an impossible, which is the menu here at Avengers Campus. I was looking at the menu and there's so many vegetarian and vegan options. So. If that's something that interests you, there's that. I'm actually gonna try to buy both though. This actually looks bomb. Oh my god, what the heck? This guy is bubbling up like, oh my god. He's so excited. Oh my god. I, I, I'm scared. Just the chicken one. It's really hot. Not bad. It's really good. Kaisen is like spicy. melting. It's just a tiny bit spicy. Kaisen is melting because He's the only one of these boys that eats like real food. <laughs> I don't. I'm fine. No, I'm fine. You're good. You want to take a bite, Kaden? Who are you, Landon? That's mine. You got that for me. Here. Okay, I'm gonna have the impossible one. Why is it impossible? To eat? Oh, this is interesting. What? It looks like a meatball with like. Yeah. Is it, how is the impossible? Impossible oh, meat's really good. Well, can I take I this part? I usually can't tell the difference. They must have just opened it. Dude, look at this. She got the ticket for the food, and my mom got the ticket for the food. The logging on, yes. so we're gonna get the food! Can you just open that? Oh, okay, yeah, if you didn't know. <laughs> Spider Man now. I'm just gonna get everything. Do you hear that? Yeah. I like literally think I'm gonna get one of everything. I think that's probably easier for you than. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm probably gonna eat something there. Okay, so, so they have oranges. They oranges. Have oh, oranges, 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 oranges. I'll just open it. Okay. Chicken sandwich. I want a chicken oh, sandwich. Wait, Give me oh, that. Wait. No. We will see you when we oh, get yeah. to yeah, the yeah. restaurant. Do you need <laughs> Update. Just as we sat down, they opened up a order, a mobile order for Pim's Kitchen. So make sure that you're checking throughout the day because earlier, 10 minutes ago, it showed nothing and now there is. I tried both the Impossible and the chicken of these. I personally am not a fan of either. Kaisen did like the chicken though, right? You like the chicken one? Are you done with it though? You wanna carry it with you? So we just made an order for like some real food over at Pim's Kitchen. I'm so excited. I practically got one of everything. I think my stomach That's got the best me. of me and my wallet because we're starving and we ordered everything. So let's go I, get it, guys. I don't think we're gonna eat everything. I don't think so either. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> Look at you guys. Watch it shrink it. Watch it, watch it, ready? <gasps> it's just the pretzel. And then he's gonna make it big. <laughs> so here's the thing with this place. So this place is known to have food look really funky. It's either really big or really small. Because Ant-Man shrinks it. Because he shrinks it. How does he make he it? He makes it big. He's a superhero. So that's what this food kitchen is based off of, is that they take regular food and they make it either really big or really small. Um, can you give me a really small pretzel and a really big one? Well, we're, we got a really big pretzel. Look at that pretzel. 
outfit is huge. Bun smaller. Hmm, what do you think? And they made the chicken smaller or the bun's bigger. Oh, I don't know. What do you think? Did you get not so little sandwich? I did. That's the not so little chicken sandwich. Breakfast slash lunch slash dinner is served. Okay, Look at this table. This is mine. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Mom, can I taste one of these? Yeah, it's a boba. It's delicious. That one's yours. So we've got the quantum sized pretzel. Pimini. <laughs> Pimini. Pimini. Yeah. Like with an M. Like mini. Mini. Sandwich. We got a spider bot. We've got the not so little chicken sandwich. These are what these are actually called, by the way. And it looks like the bun is shrunk. The chicken, well, chicken's large also. So it's a combination of both. The Caesar or, salad. Or, or is the bun big and the chicken small? Or is, we don't know. The world may never know. We've got the Caesar salad and colossal crouton. I guess the crouton is what's big here. And they literally just give you like half of a head of freaking salad. We've got the impossible spoonful here. So this is actually impossible meatball and like rigatoni. This thing is really cool. This is one of the kids meals. This is the PB and J flavor labs. What I like about this is that like my picky kids, a lot of the times they only want like they only want jelly or they only want peanut butter or they want, you know, you get to do it yourself here. Comes with an orange. We've got the mini pasta and, and impossible mini meatballs. And this is the subatomic chicken sandwich. And again, kids meal, kids meal, kids meal. And then this has like the massive chicken sandwich with a little tiny bun. And it comes with like yogurt with like boba or whatever it is. Let me hear you say I'm ready. Uh-huh, come on. Now slide, slide, slide to the bar. Shine, shine, shine like the star. Tyson, what's your verdict? What? Uh huh. Best thing you've ever tasted in your mouth. Best thing you've ever tasted in your mouth. Wow, that's a strong statement. Last but not least, we got one of these to try. The kids decided last minute that they might not want to try it. You want to try it, Kaden? You want to try it, Kaden? No. flavored. Landon, try it. After all of our reactions, he's like, yeah, no thanks. Yeah, it's it's interesting. You have to be fond of the flavors. <laughs> One last good goodbye to the Avengers campus. Goodbye, Spidey. Goodbye, Avengers campus. You treated us well. I'm curious how long the line is now, because we waited five and a half hours to get in. Shut up, no. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Mom, how do you feel? Thank you. Thank you. Mom, how do you feel? No line. Oh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> There's no line to get in right now. Hi! <laughs> Thank you! Okay, we got in at 2.15 and 7.55 and we just left, so two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it took us five hours to get in. We spent five hours in there. The park is open for one more hour, so we pretty much spent our whole day in, well, either waiting to get in or getting in. There's now no line to get in, so we live and we learn. It's okay, but don't make the same mistake I did. I feel like I did it the worst way possible. It was kind of a bummer, but it, it, like I said, we live and we learn, and the boys had so much fun, and they learned a few lessons in the meantime too. Like sometimes you have to wait, and you well, don't have to well, like it, but it can be worth it. Someone in that in there. Oh, there's someone. Oh yeah, I think there is someone in there. Was it worth waiting in that line to get in Avengers Campus? Kind of. Was it worth waiting in the line, Landon? Yeah. Yeah. So they had fun. We have one more hour left. We're gonna try to get a couple rides in before we have to leave. 
But we do have to exchange Kyson's jacket. There's a hole in the pocket of it, and so we're gonna have to stop. They didn't have the same size at the store that we bought it from, so we have to go to the back lot store and exchange it. So we do need to do that before it closes as well. Day. Oh my god. <laughs> we were in line this morning and I was like, shoot, I was gonna pack sunscreen, but the only type of sunscreen that I had at my house was the aerosol spray. And if you don't know, you're not allowed to bring that on a flight unless you check a bag. We didn't check a bag, so I couldn't bring it. And I was like, it's fine, I'll just buy it there. So we go in there, we're standing in the direct sunlight, and I'm like, shoot, I forgot to grab sunscreen at the store. Go ahead. And so I had to get out of line to go find sunscreen at the kiosk, which they had some, which was good. They came back and I doused them in sunscreen. Like, oh, they have not a single burn. Me, however, I don't know what I was thinking. I somehow skipped out on giving me sunscreen. <laughs> so, I'm very burnt from like, mask up. Was it everything that you expected? Yes. Yes. I, I think it'll be more, but I still loved it. Yeah. We also met some freaking awesome people. I, I can't remember how much I was able to explain earlier, but we were standing in line and they came up to say hi to us. They like watch our videos and we ended up like chatting away for five hours straight. Their name was Kaya and Sebastian. We ended up spending the rest of the day with them. I don't think either of us had any intention yeah, of like funny. hanging out for that long, um, but we did and they were so awesome and they were the ones that were actually able to. They, they're friends with a cast member that works there who was like oh no if you didn't get web slingers I'm I'm getting you on cast members can really make magic happen and they definitely did that for us because they were really bummed especially that one he was really bummed because we tried both times to get the fast pass for web slingers so that's like major downside of going to Avengers campus right now is I feel like the chances of getting web slingers are pretty low. There's a lot of people that I talked to that were like, mm, we didn't get it. I guess they only board like 60 groups instead of 200 like Rise does. But anyway, what an amazing, spectacular day. I have had the best is ever. That's it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. And we'll see you guys tomorrow in our next video. Bye. Good night. Say so have a fantastic Bye. day. Have a good, rest of your ankle day. Fantastic day. <laughs> Bye, guys. So I just close my